Surfshark VPN. Let's talk about it because it's one of the best value VPNs out there. It has over 3,200 servers in 100 countries and you get unlimited simultaneous connections. So your whole family is going to be covered. But how does it perform? What are the security features like? Is it a joy to use? Let's find out. How does Surfshark protect your privacy? Well, it hides your real IP address and encrypts your internet traffic so that nobody, including your internet service provider, your ISP, or hackers, for example, are able to track your activity. Also, Surfshark has a strict no logs policy, which was independently verified by Deloitte for the second time in June of 2025. What type of security features does Surfshark have? Surfshark uses secure encryption protocols including WireGuard, OpenVPN, and Ike v2, depending on the app that you're using, in order to keep your connection private. There's also a kill switch so that if your VPN disconnects, it'll immediately block your internet connection so that no data is leaked. You also get split tunneling with Surfshark, which they call Bypasser, where you can decide which apps use the VPN and which apps don't. And then there's the rotating IP feature, which does exactly what it says. It changes your IP address at regular intervals without interfering with your connection. Where can you connect to with Surfshark VPN? Well, they have servers in over 100 countries, which gives you plenty of options for fast connections and the ability to access content from all over the world. But they also have specialty servers. For example, Surfshark's double VPN servers, they call multi-hop. And you have the ability to create your own custom multi-hop presets. And then there's no borders mode, which helps you get around local network restrictions. Also censorship in some countries. What's the user experience like with Surfshark VPN? So Surfshark offers well-designed, easy to use apps for all of your devices. Windows, Mac, Android, iPhone, and many more. You can connect in one click or tap, search for specific servers, and easily toggle features like rotating IP or the kill switch. It's simple enough for beginners to use, but also offers a decent amount of control for advanced users. How fast is Surfshark VPN? We tested Surfshark on a MacBook Pro and a Pixel 7a, and the results were solid. The performance using the macOS app was particularly good. As a baseline, our control numbers without being connected to Surfshark VPN at the time of our testing, we were able to get a download speed of 308 megabits per second and an upload speed of 181 megabits per second. When connected to Surfshark servers, all of our tests actually came out in the high 200s for download speeds, some even in the 300 megabit per second range. For example, when we connected to a French server, we were able to get a download speed of 309 megabits per second and an upload speed of 32.5 megabits per second. Even in Chicago, we were able to get a download speed of 301 megabits per second and an upload speed of 70.8. We noticed there was a bit more variability in the upload speeds, however. For example, when we connected to an Australian server, the download speed was 291 megabits per second, but the upload speed was only 19.7 megabits per second. Compare that to a server in Canada, we were able to get a download speed also of 291 megabits per second, but a much higher upload speed of 94.2 megabits per second. Taking a look at speeds on our Pixel 7a, the control speed without a VPN was 300 megabits per second download and 49 megabits per second upload. Connected to a Chicago server with Surfshark VPN, we got a download speed of 125 megabits per second and an upload speed of 27.3. Surprisingly, when we connected to a custom multi-hop server, Manchester via Frankfurt, we were able to get 190 megabits per second download and 14.1 megabits per second upload. So quite a bit of download speed with that multi-hop server in that particular instance, even beating out that domestic Chicago server. And then when we connected to a New York server, we were able to get a download speed of 121 megabits per second and an upload speed of 35.8. 
megabits per second. So generally speaking, the drop in upload speeds wasn't as severe for us when we use the Android app versus using the Mac OS app. What's streaming like with Surfshark VPN? In our testing, it was a good experience. We were able to stream Netflix in the handful of European countries that we tested out, including Germany, France, and Spain. So if you're looking to access content from around the globe, Surfshark VPN is definitely gonna be able to help you bypass any geo restrictions. How much does Surfshark VPN cost? Well, it's one of the most affordable VPNs when you sign up for a longer term plan. At the time of this video, the two year plan averages out to $1.99 a month. So a great deal. The 12 month plan is a little bit more. It averages out to $3.19 per month. But if you wanna pay monthly with Surfshark VPN, that's quite a bit more at $9.99 per month. This is pretty standard with VPN providers. The longer that you sign up for, the better the deal is gonna be. But just remember that with Surfshark, you are getting those unlimited simultaneous connections when you sign up. And that's something that really sets it apart from the competition. So let's wrap it up. What are the pros and cons of Surfshark VPN? For pros, Surfshark has excellent privacy and security with a no logs policy and solid encryption to protect your data. They have apps for all of your devices, which are well designed and super easy to use. And with Surfshark, you can stream content from around the globe, bypassing any geo restrictions. Potential cons with Surfshark VPN? You're not gonna get all the specialty servers that you see with some of the other VPN competitors out there, such as Onion over VPN servers, which some advanced users might miss. And then Surfshark is based in the Netherlands, which is part of the Nine Eyes Alliance, which some users might not be comfortable with, even with Surfshark's no logs policy and independent audits. Still deciding on the right VPN for you? Click right here to watch our video on the top VPNs.